morning everyone another day here in El Nido we're going to be doing something a bit different today we're heading a bit down south to some waterfalls we haven't checked out any waterfalls since we've been here in the in the Philippines this time we've just been going to beaches and stuff right so yeah we're heading there now we haven't really done much the last few days because it's just been raining constantly weather's not exactly great today but yeah at least there's no rain at the moment and hopefully it stays that way and the falls are about 35 minutes south of El Nido in, a, in another place called Tai Tai. So um, yeah, we're just on our way now on these big, pretty much empty roads here. Not that much uh, traffic at the moment. It's all beautiful, just like you see in all the videos around here. So we're just on our way there now and we should be arriving there soon. So that ended up being a complete fail. We got there and uh, the, yeah, the place is closed, right? Yeah, we kind of knew this possibility existed, but we, we thought we would try to go and see if it was open or not. But yeah, we're not lucky today. Yeah, I think it opens in about 10 days. That's what the guy said. It's not El Nido. I think in El Nido, everything's pretty much open now. So since it's tide time, maybe they have a few different rules. Yeah, we're gonna try and save the day. Uh, the owner told us about like a hidden beach here that nobody goes to at all, no tourists. So yeah, we're just gonna try and find that. We think we know where it is. So yeah, hopefully that will be good at least. Look at the size of this animal. I don't know if it's a turkey or what. <laughs> nice and colorful though. Mm. All right, well, we're going off road. Get out of the way. This is real off-road. <laughs> Little trail. Alright, we can see water. <laughs> yeah. I can probably park up here, right? Or at the yeah, bottom. Better. So we just put it on our sandfly protection Pretty first. Bad. Yeah. That road back there was insane, <laughs> but we made it. So I don't even think this spot has um, a name really. We just asked some locals where the entrance was, and then they told us, uh, yeah, tourists just don't don't come here at all. And yeah, I don't think it really does have a name. It's like a proper secret beach. So yeah, there's no way for me to even tell you how to get here probably. So. Looks like it's going to remain a secret. Those are little butterflies, right? Yeah. Look at those are orange butterflies. <laughs> and dogs. Hello, doggo. <laughs> Got another one here as well. So yeah, it's like a few little beaches. Shame it's not sunny, but yeah, as you can see, it seems like more of a fisherman's beach. Just loads of little fishing boats. Got some epic islands as usual all over here. All the island hopping ones. I think that one's called Lagan. I know there's a nice resort on that one. Probably fly my drone over there soon. Where should we go on this other beach with no boats? Yeah. Yeah. 
Hello, doggo. So even though it's kind of cloudy, it's still super humid, so yeah, still sweating and stuff, really hot. So definitely gonna still take a dip. Still nice and transparent here. If the, if it was sunny, I think it'd be really clear like the other ones we've been going to. I think there's even more beaches around those rocks. So loads of little beaches here. Jellyfish. What, jellyfish? Yeah, jellyfish. Where? Over there somewhere. Big one or a little no, one? It was uh, medium, but it was very transparent, so it's dangerous. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Where? Oh, oh yeah. Big one there. I don't know if you can see loads of transparent jellyfish here. There's a big one over there. Yeah, that didn't go very well. We're not gonna be swimming in here. So there was the big group of jellyfish and then I just went to the other side, walked to the other side where I thought there wouldn't be any. And then when I was actually walking out of the, the sea, yeah, I got stung. Only the second time I've ever been stung in my life. The first time was also El Nido last year, but they were a lot smaller. This one's stinging a lot more. Yeah, so you can definitely see it here like all these little like balls now it's red as well yeah that guy got me good we know that vinegar is good but we don't have vinegar here so you're gonna be insane yeah i think so have you ever been stung yeah many times in brazil brazil they have a lot right yeah <laughs> oh, it really sucks trees and plants on this part quite a variety check this thing out here I'm not even sure what it is nice color though orange yellow seems to have a seed in the middle whoa <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure what that is I don't know if you can eat that <laughs> then over here check, check this out for a, a cool plant not even sure what you call that either loads of spikes on it the whole thing's covered in spikes all of them so even in rain season it's too hard to predict what the day is going to be like right yeah i think 80 percent of the day is cloudy but sometimes there are some sunny moments like now yeah but you can predict 
Yeah, you just gotta go out and hope for the best. <laughs> Does look uh, a lot better in the sun though. Yeah, like I was saying before though, water, it's not as nice as like Nakpan and Dooley, but yeah, still looks pretty nice. I'm not, I'm not going in there again though, the, the enemy is waiting for me. It was around there that I got stung. <laughs> Just gonna walk past these rocks at the end of the beach. I saw in the drone shots that there's another little beach here, so yeah, we thought we might as well check it out before we leave. I got a black butterfly there. Whoa, purple as well. Stay still. <laughs> Look at that one, Carol. Beautiful. Beautiful. Yeah. And another duck. <laughs> this is the dog beach that I think we've seen about five or six. <laughs> Here we go, the even more hidden beach. So Carol decided to stay back there. I'm just checking out this beach quickly. Looks pretty epic here, look, look how big this is. Big jungle. Just see what's around this corner here. <laughs> yeah, it seems to just go on and on. Looks like a pretty nice beach down that way. So we're still in a big bay here, so I can even see there's like another, I don't know, little village over there and I can see some beaches as well. So all the way around here you'll get these little hidden beaches everywhere. Yeah, you probably noticed from our videos that El Nido is just one of those places that it doesn't really matter where you go or where you explore, just everything is beautiful around here. Like even the pretty basic beaches like this. Well, basic for the Philippines, it's still very nice to visit. And yeah, the entire scenery here is always like this, like jungle and woods. So yeah, it just looks beautiful. Super green everywhere or super blue. Just an amazing spot. Check out the sound of the insects here, singing away. So we come back to the first beach and now there's loads of locals here. A picnic. Beach picnic. <laughs> Hello. 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 <laughs> Hi. Hi. <laughs> Hello everyone. Hello. Having a picnic? Yeah. Yeah. Sunday. Family Bundy. Sunday picnic day. Yeah. All right, nice, nice spot. Yep. Very nice beach. This is one of the exclusive beach here in Indonesia. No tourists come. No tourists. No, we only found because uh, our the owner of our place he told us about here in El Nido. How long you been here in, in, in Lido? Three months. Three months. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we can't go. From which country? Brazil. Brazil. Yeah. Neymar. Yeah, Neymar. <laughs> yeah, very nice here. You've been, you've been to Nakwan? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Dooley Beach. Everywhere. Everywhere, nice. Yeah. <laughs> we tried to go to the the falls. Yeah, They're yes. closed. Yeah, it's closed. Yeah. You can try in the Lido. Uh, no, not yet. Maybe we, I think that's open. I think but open. I think here's nicer, yeah? You should, you should try also the canopy walk. 
Oh, is it? It's open. It's open. Uh, oh, yeah. I've been there yesterday. Oh yeah. Been, uh, to like a forest. It's easy. Yeah. It's easy. Easy. You, you got a harness. It's safe. You have to get it. Okay. Oh, yeah, nice, to nice to meet you. So we're getting back on the the scooter now. Need to head back in the town and get something to eat. Didn't bring any snacks today. Before I close out this video, I wanted to announce the launch of our website. Carol uh, created a website for us, so um, yeah, I just wanted to show you a bit of that. So here it is, we used uh, Squarespace to create it, well Carol did, she did all this, so yeah, we finally got around to creating a website here. Uh, you can find some information about us, we created a page just explaining a bit of our background, stuff like that. We also have other things like contact information, ways that you can support us, some discount links, Airbnb and Epidemic, and we also have a section with our gear. A lot of you often ask what gear we're using for backpacking and camera gear, so yeah, we have that here as well. And another thing that Carol created is a merchandise uh, section, so yeah, we finally have some merch now. We had been meaning to do this for a long time, so we're using Teespring, which is a site that a lot of YouTubers use, so um, yeah, you have like hoodies, phone cases, uh, mugs, cushions, I think there's stuff for uh, kids as well, the sizes, so yeah, loads of different things, and yeah, Carol designed pretty much all of this, so yeah, if you're interested, you can check that out as well. You also have some stickers. And I think since this site, Teespring, is linked to YouTube, you might actually be able to see the merch below the video, so yeah, a lot of you guys had asked in the past why we didn't have merch, and it's also a good way to support us and get something in return so we finally created that and there'll probably be more things appearing there more designs and stuff um yeah we just gotta work on it that's all so yeah so check out the site and the store if you're interested and uh once again just thanks for watching not sure what the next video is going to be it all depends on weather and yeah just different things so uh yeah just stay tuned for whatever's coming up follow us on instagram and subscribe to this channel if you haven't already and we'll see you around